CompTIA Network Plus N10-009 Practice Exam Questions 161 through 165 This video is part of our practice exam video series and is filled with questions that closely resemble the real exam. So are you prepared to test your knowledge? Great, let's begin. Question 161 a network administrator needs to centralize log collection for all web servers to improve monitoring and troubleshooting. The solution must send event data over port 514 to a dedicated log server. Which of the following services will best accomplish this task? The answer is B. Syslog. Syslog is a standardized logging protocol used to collect and transmit event messages from network devices, servers, and applications to a centralized log server. It operates over port 514 and allows administrators to monitor system activity, detect issues, and ensure compliance. By implementing Syslog, all web servers can send logs in real time to a central repository enabling better visibility and analysis of system events. Question 162. A security administrator wants to detect and analyze new attack techniques before they can target the corporate network. Which of the following security mechanisms would best help accomplish this? The answer is C. Honeypot. A honeypot is a security mechanism designed to attract, detect, and analyze malicious activity by simulating a vulnerable system. Attackers, including those using zero-day exploits, may attempt to compromise the honeypot, allowing security teams to observe their techniques and develop countermeasures. While solutions like next-generation firewalls and intrusion prevention systems can detect threats, a honeypot is specifically designed to study attacker behavior and uncover unknown threats in a controlled environment. Question 163. A network administrator is troubleshooting a network issue and needs to determine which switch port a specific PC is connected to. After using the show arc command to find the MAC address associated with the PC's IP address, which of the following commands should be used next? The answer is C. Show MAC address table. The show MAC address table command is used to display the MAC address table on a switch, showing which MAC addresses are associated with specific switch ports. After using show arc to identify the PC's MAC address, the administrator can use show MAC address table to determine the exact switch port the PC is connected to. This helps in troubleshooting connectivity issues or verifying physical connections within the network. Question 164. A remote employee frequently accesses the company's intranet site to download internal documents. Today, after typing the usual web address, they are redirected to a website that looks similar, but is prompting them to enter login credentials again. Which of the following is the most likely cause? The answer is D. DNS poisoning. DNS poisoning occurs when an attacker manipulates DNS records to redirect users to a fraudulent website. In this case, the employee is unknowingly sent to a malicious duplicate of the company's intranet, which could be used for credential theft or malware distribution. Question 165. A network engineer is designing an enterprise network using a three-tier hierarchical model. When following a bottom-up approach, which of the following is the correct sequence of layers in the three-tier architecture? The answer is A. Access, Distribution, and Core The three-tier hierarchical model consists of access, distribution, and core layers. The access layer connects end-user devices to the network. The distribution layer aggregates traffic, applies policies, and routes between VLANs. The core layer provides high-speed backbone connectivity. The bottom-up approach starts from the access layer and moves upwards, ensuring a scalable and efficient network design. So, did any of these questions give you a tough time? Don't worry if they did, it's all part of the learning process. Luckily, Certification Synergy has a wealth of free video content at your disposal. To stay connected with our latest IT learning resources, just give a quick click on the subscribe button. This simple action ensures you're always updated about our newest video releases. Thank you for watching. Subscribe for more great content.